The following video is a brief overview of what you could include for your digital portfolio. Show us your creativity. At LSAD, we celebrate creativity. Our wide range of courses specializing in everything from fine art design to digital content creation are intended to empower creativity in all its forms and produce valued sought after graduates. Some of our courses ask you, the prospective student, to submit a portfolio of work so that we can reward your creativity and you can showcase your passions and skills. Your portfolio of work is all about you and can contain creative content from your school or personal life. What is a digital portfolio? A digital portfolio is a digital representation of your creative skills, abilities, interests and personality. It, it can include photographs and videos of your physical work such as painting, sculptures and fashion items, as well as files containing your digital work, such as digital art, images, photography, 3D models, designs, videos and animation. Your digital portfolio can also include videos of notebooks containing research sketches and exploratory work. The contents and inspiration for your portfolio can come from many sources, including, for example, Leaving Cert subjects such as art, music, design and communication graphics, technology, construction studies, engineering, computer science and home economics. Portfolio work can consist of projects which you have already completed in secondary school or on a PLC and which have recorded through photographs or video. However, not all the work in your portfolio needs to come from, it, from an educational setting. It is always good to see work that you have created in your own time or from your involvement in other creative activities as members of various groups or clubs or your involvement in creative competitions. Please also feel free to include unfinished work or work in progress or work which you created as part of a collaborative team. There is no formula for a portfolio. It is as individual as the person putting it together. However, we will ask you to be selective and limited to 20 pieces. So select the work that you feel best about and that you think represents your creative skill set. We have gathered a selection of work from a number of portfolio submissions over the years, so it is important to note that this is not one individual portfolio and is only a guide as to what you could include. Life drawing. It is nice to see a selection of life drawing. This does not have to be work you have done in school or PLC. It could be a parent or guardian at home watching TV or a friend, sibling or flatmate. It also is nice to see the surroundings they are in, whether it be on the couch or sitting at the kitchen table. Consider maybe doing a 5, 10 or 15 minute sketch. These could be done as line drawings or do done with pencil or more detailed tonal piece done with charcoal or oil pastel. Photography. You could include one or two pages of photography. These could be taken digitally or using a film camera. You can capture great quality images with smartphones, which can also have features for sh slow shutter speed and photo editing or time lapse for video pieces. Things to consider could be your subject, composition and lighting. Analytical drawing. It is nice to see some analytical drawings in your portfolio. These could be of a man-made or organic object. Look at visual elements such as line, tone, texture, colour, shape and form. Drawing your object from different angles and points of view using different mediums such as ink, pencil, charcoal, collage, paint or colouring pencils or whatever materials you have to hand. You could look at an object's silhouette or you could do a close-up of a detailed drawing using a viewfinder like you can see here. Print. You could include some prints, let it be woodcut, lino, mono or dry point. Or maybe creating patterns using a potato stamp. These could be one, two or three colour prints and can be done on paper, fabric or any other materials you have to hand. Self-portraits. Here are two examples of some self-portraits using paper collage and ink. Use a mirror and get creative with materials. Maybe consider working in a larger scale for this. Graphic design. If design is something you are interested in and maybe you help design a logo or flyer for a friend's company or maybe for a transition year company, you could include that in your portfolio. 
Seeing ideas or sketches are just as interesting as the finished piece, as I mentioned earlier. We do not need to see work finished or on a computer. All ideas usually start with a pencil and a piece of paper. Animation. If animation is your thing, or sound or video, you can include storyboards or links to short video pieces within your portfolio. And finally, sculpture. Any large scale work or 3D pieces can be photographed for your digital portfolio. Maybe consider the location or the backdrop to really make your work stand out.